Hey guys, how you doing? It's Lauren with X-Grid Campers, and we are here today to talk about a brand new product coming out from Opus. Uh, for those of you that have spent time really researching or looking at the OP2 and the OP4, this is a combination of both. It's very, very exciting. It's called the Opus OP4 Limited Edition Model. These are gonna be coming to the US here in 2024. Uh, we have the first two units right now in our shop, and I wanted to give you a quick walkthrough of what to expect and how the OP4 Limited Edition is a brand new, unique model and what we're so excited about. Let's take a look. All right, so what's great about the OP4 Limited Edition is that it combines the best of what the OP2 offers with the bed layout of the OP4. So a lot of people love the OP2 because it has a split kitchen design. All right, the stove and the sink is on the left side and the refrigerator is on the right side of the step. So you have a very wide area for when you're doing your cooking and living outside. Whereas the OP4, it's back to back. You have the stove and the, and the refrigerator right back to back. So you have to walk around the stove to get to the, uh, to the refrigerator. So the OP2 gives you that split kitchen. Well, the OP4 limited edition does the same thing. So it combines the best of the OP4 plus the OP2 all in one. So let me show you real quick here what I'm talking about. The OP4, again, this is a very similar tongue box to what we have on the OP2. It's much, much wider. So as we open it up, we have the slide out for the fridge, but we also have this fantastic pantry and kitchen cabinet area. Really, really deep cabinet here that you can put all your kitchenware, all the cookware, utensils, pots and pans, and a slide back drawer up on top. Goes really deep, nice and large, lots of space. This is something that you don't get on a normal OP4. Another nice thing they've done here on the OP4, on the OP4 limited edition is a single action slide out. So nice drawbar right here, drop this down, all Opus branded, slides out, and you have the same size fridge as we have in the other two units. So this is fantastic, really nice setup, gives you a lot more storage, a lot of area to put your gear, um, and it's very similar to OP2. Now again, what we have on the OP2 is the kitchen on the side. We don't normally see this on the floor, which is what we have on the limited edition. So we have the split kitchen, we have lots of open area. Same kitchen design that Opus is famous for, the four burner stove, the drying rack for the dishes, the cutlery drawer underneath and everything like that. And then you have your pull out prep table. A couple of nice little features they've added here, a little bottle opener and a lock mechanism for this prep, out, for this prep table underneath. So that's the kitchen and the exterior area of the OP4 limited edition. Before I go on the inside, I wanna show you a couple more features on the front and the other side. Let's take a look. Okay, so on the front of the OP4 limited edition, this is also something that's been asked for a lot. We actually have two 20 pound propane tanks. Um, for those of you that know, the OP2 comes with two 20 pounds, but the OP4 has always only come with a single 20 pound propane tank. So now with the OP4 limited edition, we do have the two 20 pound tanks. And of course, as uh, similar with all Opus units, we are running the Cruise Master DO35 coupler, as well as the ARK 750 jack on the front. Uh, these units are still equipped with the DC to DC charger. This is very common on uh, 22 and 23 models going forward, where it's already pre-wired for DC to DC with a 50 amp Anderson, and we can install the charger here at Extra Campers. Let me show you a couple other things. All right, now on the driver's side, again, because we have that extra large toolbox uh, rack on the front, uh, we have tons of storage. So you have the large slide, again, single action, slide out, large tray, gives you plenty of room to put those large tote boxes and everything you need to there. Uh, very similar as you have the 30 amp shore power, the solar uh, connection, the SA solar connection. But one of the other things I really like now is what they've done with this cargo rack. As you guys may remember, the typical cargo rack for the OP2 and the OP4 has a wire frame. It's not real strong, it's been up, we've had some rust problems with it. This is an all alloy uh, for, uh, cargo rack now, a lot more sturdy, has these large crossbars. You can mount more gear to it, a lot easier to strap things down. So we're really excited about that as well. Um, one thing that's equipped on the inside of the unit, which we're gonna show you in a few minutes, is the Truma Combi. So instead of having an instant hot water heater that you have on the OP2 and the OP4, this is now the Truma Combi, so there's an onboard hot water system, the same system we're running in the Opus OP15. With that, you don't have the Pelican case with the EcoTemp anymore. It's built in. So now, without the EcoTemp, we actually have the water plumbed through the hot and cold 
on the shower compartment on the outside. So we do have hot and cold running water here right now, and you do have still hot and cold quick connects underneath if you need to hose off and you need a different connection there. This unit will come equipped with a shower enclosure, the same fold out shower enclosure. We don't have it on this unit yet, but it will be provided. Now let's go back inside and take a look at the features of the inside of the OP4 limited edition. Okay, so now we're on the inside of the OP4 LE and uh, this is exactly what you expect from Opus with this large eight foot ceiling and the two beds. But let me show you a couple things that they've changed which are really nice. But let's start with the cushions. Uh, the cushions on the dinette are fantastic. It's a light gray with a dark bluish gray banding. Look really sharp a lot more updated and modern than the old tan ones with that red cording. So this is a very, very nice improvement that we're happy about. The other thing that we're excited about is all the cabinetry now is aluminum. So we have an aluminum base for everything um, and the bamboo are accents around it to kind of give it that warmth and nice feeling. So this is all aluminum. This used to be wood. Uh, so this is a really nice addition they've done. The lagoon table also comes standard. So instead of having that clunky table that you unfold and pull out and inside and everything, this is now on a swivel. We can move this around, position it where we want to, um, and have plenty of room to get inside now. And just like the previous OP4, this drops down into the uh, bed so you can turn this into a bed uh, for you know another place to sleep. One of the other things that I love about this is the new mattress they've added to both beds on the OP4 limited edition. This is a thicker mattress. Uh, it's got a lot more cushion there. It makes it a lot more comfortable to sleep on and lay on. Um, but the, also the cover is nice and soft. Uh, so we're really happy about what they've done with that. Um, let me show you real quick now what's powering up the OP4 LE. Uh, first, as I mentioned before, we are running the Truma Combi system. So this is your hot water and furnace uh, set up in one. So now we have hot water plumbed to the sink as well as the exterior shower. And for power management, we're running the, the Renogy inverter charger. So this is going to provide your 30 amp shore, shore charging plus an inverter that's already wired back to your 110 receptacles on the inside as well as the outside. All right, guys, so I hope you enjoyed the walk around of the OP4 limited edition. This is a 2024 model. We expect them to come to market really in the kind of Q1, Q2 of 2024, but we do have two units now available out of X grid campers, both in Las Vegas and Knoxville, Tennessee. So if you're interested in being one of the first adopters on this brand new model from Opus, please reach out, give us a call, text us or email us, xgridcampers.com. Thanks for watching.